Yeah. I like mean, it's like, insane, man. At Encore, if you look at these brackets, like, the, the sheer stackedness mm -hmm. of it. Three, two, one, go! Alright, okay. getting right into game one here. Mm -hmm. Okay, we got, we got the Squirtle, we got the uh, uh, the Ness. We're gonna see a lot of buttons, a lot of buttons. There's definitely a button-heavy matchup. It's a button-heavy matchup. But look at the spacing mm -hmm. between these two. It's like very, very careful spacing. Mm -hmm. No jump. Oh, no jump might be really bad. Okay. He can air dodge the ledge. I think that's what his game plan is. Oh, oh he's gone bad. You could go down there. Yeah, you could just take the hit. Ooh, I wonder why he could have just took the hit. He wasn't gonna die from it. Yeah. Maybe he didn't want to have to I put himself in a tech situation. I think maybe he, he uh, kind of reacted a little bit late. He, he's confident. Like, I can kill him without having to take all of that damage. That yeah. might be the reasoning. I mean, we'll see. Uh, yeah, let's see if it pays off, right? That's, that's the thing about PK Chris. He always recognizes when he, there's a platform that he could uh, <laughs> PK Fire cancel on. Oh, oh, cheeky. No, I, I'm half convinced he purposefully sent that, uh, the Razor Leaf into the stage. Uh huh. To beat him. Nice. Yeah, mixing I, it up there. Yeah, mixing it up, and it's actually Kim Quid, uncharacteristically, not really able to get these edge guards. Mm -hmm. Okay, Chris just doing a great job of avoiding the worst of it. Ooh, that was scary. Chris, and I'm not mad at that for Chris either, because he's going to die next time he gets hit. Ooh, and he's able to take the stop. I, I'm not mad at that at all. Kind of went for it there. 153, why not? I'm living on borrowed time right now anyways. And just like that, give it to him. He was in the blast zone just now. He called him an Uber to the blast zone. Oh, no, that would have been, been nuts. Okay. Quick can kind of breathe a little bit right now. All right. <laughs> He's going back to Squirtle, but this is kind of tricky here because he's now at 70%. Squirtle mm -hmm. being very light means if he gets hit by like yes. one more thing, he could very well be at death percent. You know, one combo with back throw at ledge, yeah, you're gone. Yeah, he definitely doesn't want to get hit with a PK fire right now or a grab because you're taking damage, but this is good. Speaking of grab damage, some nice percentage being tacked onto PK Chris mm -hmm. from Quid, and now we're seeing the swap to Ivysaur. I will say, so far the Ivysaur has not really been, normally it's his best character, but... Yep. Oh my god, yep, I stand that was, that was a little uh, bold <laughs> of PK Chris to throw out that smash move up there, over there. Now he just reversed the whole game. Quid's saying pretty right now, if you can make it back to the stage. You know the funny thing about Quid, the way he plays? Like, when you look at his portal, it's so careful. You know, really clearly you see how good his neutral and his game plan is. And then when he goes Ivysaur, then he also has this ridiculous cheese potential. Ooh, ooh, that's what he was afraid of before. I'm not mad at that either. Man. The only issue there was that uh, Chris was able to PK Thunder, and the tail on the wraparound hit him before he was able to get the down air out. So unfortunate. Oh, that movement was so slick. Mm -hmm. Ooh, nice coverage of the change, the quick switch. Bruh! Bruh! <laughs> it actually <laughs> did? <laughs> what? He just brought it around town. Let me just go around the world real quick. Uh, <laughs> let me just go back to my house real quick. I'll be back. He boomeranged the PK uh, Thunder real quick. <laughs> That's like that, uh, like that, uh, the Simpsons meme where Mo throws Barney out and then Barney just appears behind him again. What? <laughs> you know what I'm talking about? <laughs> no, I've never seen great, that meme. It's a great meme for Now you have to show me the meme. <laughs> I'll, I'll, I'll find it for you, but it's just like, you, th you, you know, throughout the PK Thunder, you clap your hands being like, mm -hmm. that's that, and then all of a sudden he just spawns behind him. <laughs> oh, I'm gonna go to Yoshi's. First of all, I ban the stage every time. I don't care who I'm playing against. Where we are, what day it is, what time it is, this stage is getting banned. But, uh, Quid, like, listen, I like this stage. And I guess these edges will give uh, Ivy a little bit more uh, pizzazz on, the, on his down airs and stuff. And also, maybe it'll be a little bit easier to sort of anticipate the PK Thunder bounces. Mm, you know, okay. it can be, like, on those stages that have the, you know, the diagonal you know, sides of the stage. Yeah. It's kind of like, where is he really going to get bounced to? Mm, it's a lot. Yes, true. Now he only he has to come either diagonally from out to, from the blast zone, or he has to ride the wall straight up. So 
Yeah, get out of the race for sure. Oh, there's, there's no doubt in my mind that Uppy would have killed him. Bro, you're not safe. Sit in the shields. Stay right there in that shield. Because once I start doing these up airs, like, listen, you're not safe. It's just explosions. Mmm, so I should get the uh, paper grab. Doesn't get it, though. Oh, beautiful spacing. All of this damage. Oh! <gasps> that actually... It, he took it all the way. What was I, that? I can't believe it. Is he, oh, oh, my God. I thought we were going to see a That was wild. That entire time, Chris was just waiting for the combo to be over. <laughs> and Chris like, nah, this ain't over till the stock is gone, my guy. Just that, like, don't worry, I'll finish the combo. You should have saw his face when he died. It was like, bro, how did you even do this? Listen. Up throw? throw? Mm, I couldn't do it. That was a little dangerous by uh, Quinn. All right, I think we might actually see the Star Charizard stay for a little while here. Never mind. Yep. <laughs> just like that one just proved you wrong. He heard you. He was like, listen, you're wrong. <laughs> How dare you think I would play Charizard for even an instant? Charizard? I mean, I think he really did want to get back to Ivysaur. Mm, drops the combo. I know he could have got more damage out of that. This is scary. Good. Listen, if you play Ness and you're not able to stall your up B or mix it up like that, listen, you're going to die to Ivy every time. Any other Ness, that's a stock. That's a stock for uh, Quid. And that back here is a stock for Quid, too. <laughs> the, the no kill screen. I think that was maybe some questionable DI. Oh, yeah, 100%. They say that if you don't get the uh, the kill screen or any sparks or anything, that means you DI'd bad if you uh, if you die. But I mean, it looked like he was going straight to blast zone regardless. I it wasn't that move. It, I mean, it's still strong. Don't mm -hmm. get me wrong. The Charizard mm -hmm. back air is strong regardless. Yeah. But it isn't it, it isn't the monstrous thing if you don't sweet spot it. Mm -hmm. So. All right. Looks like we're gonna be going to Spear Pillar. Never mind. Okay. <laughs> Yo, legalized spear pillar. <laughs> What's the worst that could spear happen? Pillar. Listen, you gotta know how to play with reverse controls. <laughs> if you don't, then yeah, you're not right. good at the game. You don't deserve to win. Yeah, just flip your controller upside down. Just play with your face. Yep. <laughs> so now we're gonna have game three on FD. I actually really like the stage choice from PK Chris. Okay. Just remember what those platforms did in the last game. Yeah, he could not get off the platforms at all. Once he was on there, he was taking damage trying to get down. Yeah, and this means we're probably gonna be seeing a lot more neutral heavy matchup uh, between these two. Yeah, and like look at oh, oh that's big. Oh. Charger gun again. I, I, he should have taken the hit, right? Yeah. Right 100%. there. So once you get once the nest is far enough away, if you're at low percentage, you don't even have to hit him. Just let him hit you and casually go back to the stage. Because in this game, they decided to make it so that if Ness gets hit during his P PK Thunder uh, hit animation, he doesn't go as far. Like, it's like cut by like 60%. Like, it's pretty it, wild. It's like a 40%, I'd say, decrease. All right, but yeah, like I said the ratio backwards. <laughs> <laughs> So he only has about 60% of it. And that's a big yeah. approximation. Mm -hmm. um, no God, tech that time. That's so hard to tech, though. Just remember, yeah, because there's so many hit. hits to it, yeah. and you don't even know if you're you, right. You can't even just count that, because mm -hmm. you don't know if you got hit by the mm -hmm. first hit or not. And then you got the IV kind of dragging you into the blast zone, so you might fall out and accidentally air dodge. There's just so much. You're right. There's so much that goes into that. All right. Yeah, Ness. <laughs> just uh, some questionable shield pressure coming out from Quid because Ness has some of the best like out of shield options in yeah, the game. Yeah, for honestly. sure, for sure. They're all pretty fast, and just about all of them will kill you, except for like fair and like down and stuff. He didn't get his jump back. Yeah, he didn't die. Why? I don't think he wanted to show get up. I think he probably wanted to do like jump down there, but mm -hmm. his button came out wrong. Spacing that. Yikes. Oh, like pixels away from getting grabbed. Hey, don't you even think you're going to parry it either. That move is really good for uh, Ivy's, uh, Ivy's uh, kick. Also, do you notice the way he actually angled his uh, PK Thunder to get a bounce to grab Back the ledge? Mm. But yeah, and this is the sort of thing where not only does Quid have the lead in terms of stocks, in terms of percentage and all that, it feels like he has the mental lead. You oh, know absolutely. what I mean? Yeah, Chris is definitely, uh, he's younger, so he does get tilted a little bit easier. He's not as young as Quid, though. 
It's like 16 feet. Quid? Yeah. Yeah, I mean, bro, the young boys are uh, running running away with this game, man. <laughs> <laughs> okay, doesn't space that back air. That's something that had been, like, consistently really good from Quid, but yeah. one mistake, and you can see how it can really cost you. 100%. Ness's punish game, top three free in this game. When it comes to just punishing characters for doing something small, wrong. I definitely agree with that. And that's why Quid is being so careful. It's, he keeps baiting him into going for this. Oh, I love the down jump usage. Oh, the, man, what is going on here? Should be Ooh, oh. straight through the. I got fired too. <laughs> okay, here we go. Now, uh, this, I mean, Quid's in pretty. Got two stocks left. Chris kind of, kind of has to figure out. Nice. If he wasn't Charizard, he was dying there. So that oh, was a yeah. great switch by him. Okay. That's really good, right? Because if you don't know, oh, that's going to be yep. it. Yeah, no way Goodbye. he's going to be surviving that. Goodbye. And that's actually one thing that a good reason to switch Charizard is the out of shield. Mm -hmm. The fact that he has a B, which uh, there are a lot of moves that PK, like, you know, Ness in general will throw out. And